what we are doing, we, we are going to address this issue in a more methodical way, in a more organized way. First and foremost, we must understand the UPND manifesto. What's the UPND manifesto? We were very clear that we were going to restructure the debt, isn't it? Very, very clear. We were going to restructure the economy. We were elected on the ticket of change. What was the change? Economy, to rebuild the economy, which was destroyed in the last seven years. And amongst those is this, to dismantle the debt. To dismantle the debt, you need an IMA program. It's a, it's a very simple thing. It's not even as complicated as people would like to make it look. And uh, once you have an IMF program, it's an endorsement of credibility. Then we are now going to the lenders to now deal with the debt restructuring. This is the connection. It is not a secret. It's a matter that we campaign along with other messages that we get. Unless you as a journalist maybe you didn't pick those issues. We were very, very clear at that time that we needed to restructure the debt. And the issue is that the PF were working for seven years to conclude an IMA program. Seven years, eh? Five, two, seven. Five plus two is seven, right? We were able to do it in two months. The question is that, why did the PF want, it, want an IMA program? It's the same reason, except they had no credibility to deliver an IMA program. Four ministers failed to deliver an IMA program. Chikwanda, right? The list you know. I don't want to continue with the list. We have done it in two months. Credibility, seriousness. Now it opens the door to restructure the overall debt. Because that's what we say. We don't restructure the debt. We don't get a shedding off of the debt. It means every budget, my dear friend, my dear friend, every budget will be consumed by two items as there has been the past what are those two items one debt service isn't it two public sector expenditure two items every year checks the tax you pay the tax he pays the tax you pay do you agree to that the answer is no so we are doing the right thing it's a restructuring, it's an economic restructuring, and you will see growth from there. The reason that the country was going down was because the, the guys who were in office before, as colleagues in office before, failed to do in seven years what we've done in two months. They must learn to say thank you, HH. Thank you, Minister of Finance. Here is the issue. Debt on one side, we deal with it. Two. Right? Public expenditure. Why are we talking about buying goods and services in government at the right price? Quality, three, deliver on time, is to suppress public expenditure so that these two items that has been taking money can release money now for development, for job creation, for growth, for health, for education. Here's the good news. Once we create savings in this area, we shift the money where it needed most. The vulnerable, the women, the youth, students for meal allowances. Someone will be unhappy for a short while, a greater number of people will be happy for a longer time, and the economy will be put on the right, right track. That's what it is.